Turning to the housing market now. In June, existing home sales fell for the fifth straight month nationwide. Yeah, it's a trend we've seen not just nationally, but here at home. So what does that mean for would-be buyers? NBC's Tom Costello explored that, even highlighting our local housing market. Take a look. Anyone shopping for a home in the last few years has seen it firsthand. U.S. home sales going from hot to ridiculous. All cash offers, bidding wars, inspection contingencies waived. Now, in places like Boise, Idaho, those days appear to be over. We've gone from you know, hours on market to potentially six months. Realtor Shauna Pendleton says potential buyers are concerned about the future. Inflation, gas prices, I mean, just everything happening in our world is causing people, just buyers, to be very nervous, very hesitant. The same dynamic is taking place in other regions that experienced pandemic booms, like Salt Lake City, Denver, and Seattle. The National Association of Realtors says home sales are down 21% since January. Economists say that's not a bad thing. Lower price growth in housing is absolutely healthier. Uh, it's a more sustainable market. It is generally better for shoppers to find that good match. So what's the problem? Interest rates for home mortgages are up and could be going higher. The current national average for a 30-year fixed is above 5.5%. That's up from a low of 2.65% in January 2021. If you're thinking about buying a house, what should you do right now? Well, if you're actively shopping and you feel like you could be ready to go soon, locking a mortgage rate right now is probably not a bad idea. That's because if inflation continues to rise, the Federal Reserve will likely raise the interest rate that banks can charge each other, which in turn will likely influence mortgage rates. But experts say it's unlikely even a recession will lead to the type of crash in home values we went through in the late 2000s. The home prices still looks to be on a solid footing. Uh, fortunately, we don't have those funny, risky mortgages that was present uh, 10 years ago during the subprime lending foreclosure crisis. For now, potential buyers like Rachel Payne are pressing pause on their search, hoping home ownership becomes a little more attainable in the near future. We just have to think something's got to change, whether it is you know, prices decrease a little bit. If interest rates stay the same, we're kind of okay with that. Um, as first time home buyers, it's like the down payment is like the biggest thing for us. And it looks like we are heading in that direction. Boise Regional Realtors says the median sales price for homes in Ada County dropped to 592,000 in June. That was down from 602,000 in May, but that's still 12.8% higher compared to the same month a year ago.